big up, big up, big up, big up, big up, big up my fans, my subscriber, unsubscribe, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. I'm here to talk about that Texaco, my favorite gas station of all times, is coming back to Richmond, Virginia. My favorite gas station is coming back to Richmond, Virginia. Y'all remember um, Texaco, the, the big logo star with the T in front of it? The red star with the black T on it? Yeah, my favorite gas station is coming back in 2025. Texaco been around since 1902 by a guy named Joseph Cortland. It was first called the Texas Gas Company in 1902. In 1959, they changed it to Texaco. And then in 1990, Chevron merged with Texaco so Chevron is with Texaco Texaco been around in Virginia in Richmond Virginia in 1959 they they closed out of business in 2005 Texaco was a unique gas station because they didn't have 87 the lowest octane that they had was um, 89 and check this out certain Texacos didn't have 89 octane but they had 89 90 and 93 and then you had some Texacos that had 90 octane 92 octane and 93 octane and that's what certain Texaco gas stations mm -hmm. um, and I thought it was unique and that's why I went to them because when I went to the Texaco I always got 90 octane or 93 or if I was at the other one, I would get 89 or 93 at the other uh, Texaco's. But I'm glad I'm, I'm glad they're coming back to Richmond, Virginia. I've been there with Texaco since my high school days. And uh, don't go to Sheets. Don't go to Wawa's. Don't go to Pilot. Don't go to racetrack because they're generic um, gas companies see how it works like when these gas trucks come they go to the basic brand name or gas companies and fill in the oil then when they have enough which is called the overflow they go jump off the overflow like a racetrack sheets YY, Sam's Club, and all these all types of gas. Those in their gas stations are getting the overflow to getting the extra gas from the other oil companies. That's how that works. But do not get 87 octane because it will mess up your um, throttle body. 80, 87 octane is for like lawnmowers, ride lawnmowers, stuff like that. 87 is not good for your car. People get it because it's a low octane and it's cheap. And you don't have to pay that much. That's why it might be a dollar ninety nine, two fifty three, whatever. But it, it'll mess up your it mess up your, your throttle body and throttle bodies ain't cheap. If you're gonna go away from eighty from if you're gonna go away from ninety three get 89 don't get 87 it's not good for your car because I use 87 I had to pay 
five hundred and something for a throttle body to put on my car. Then I had to pay three three hundred for insulation. I mean for installment. But if you want to save your throttle body and keep it, don't don't use eighty seven. At least you use eighty nine. That's my gas tip for the day. <laughs>